Alright, hey there, this is Nathan from Tech Savvy, and today I'll be doing a tutorial on how to create your own custom hotkeys or key combos, which can launch applications, folders, files, programs. So let's get started. So what you're going to want to first do is go to the link that will be in the description below, as it's kind of long, so I won't list it. And what you're going to download is a program called WinHockey. It's currently on version 0.7 and just click download on this page and then just select the US version and then you should see it starting but since I already have it downloaded I'll just go to my setup so what you want to do is double click on the setup and then you want to click next and then after reading through this agreement you want to select I accept the agreement and click next then you can choose where you want to install it. I'll just go with the default location and click next. After this, you can um, choose what folder you want it to go in. I'll just leave it as the default and click next. If you want, you can add a desktop icon, which I will do for the purpose of this video. Then you'll end up on this screen and just click install. And it should go through the process and it should be really fast. And then what you want to do is launch WinHockey. And you'll be run through this short little tutorial and wait, uh, to launch one of your previously existing hockeys like let's say I want to use run I'll just do win R and you'll see this window pop up so now to create your own hockey combination just click new hockey and then if you want you can add a description I'll just write um, Chrome I guess and then I'll go Windows button um, Windows button N. So Win N will run. Uh, will launch Chrome. Okay. So if I wanted to launch Chrome, I have to search for Chrome. So what you want to do is go into Pro Program Files and then go to the place in which Chrome is installed. And then find the exe, so here it is. I'll just double click. And then it'll just launch this application. And then I'll click OK. So now if I press Start A, you should see Chrome launch. I mean Start N, sorry. There it is. And I can edit these existing hotkeys to let's say launch a folder and I can just change that to wherever whatever the location is and I can change what key presses I want to use so I could do control alt a and then chrome is launched so pretty much have fun with making these hotkeys and this is Nathan from Tech Savvy signing out You should see this window yeah. here. Choose your location. So it's so already games game. you have already have videos that can be here. Or you can drag. Right. 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 Right.